What's up guys? So this is a, a little trick that has yet to fail me. I just write down rate and realize it's not pronounced that way, but I'm just Puerto Rican, it sounds that way to me. So we've got residual volume, expiratory reserve volume, inspiratory reserve volume, and tidal volume. So once our volumes are done, we're going to work on our capacities. These first two are going to be our functional residual capacity. These last two are going to be our inspiratory capacity. These last three are going to be our vital capacity. And all of it together are going to make up our total lung capacity. Alright, there it is. And I hope it helps you guys. Okay guys, so just to teach you how to use this information in an actual question. I'm using uh, the Kaplan book for 2018 covered the question the answer so basically um, they're just giving you some information about some of the compartments and they're asking you for the inspiratory capacity so let's go back to the drawing I made um, and they're giving you these three values and they're asking you for inspiratory capacity so let's take a look at it this is inspiratory capacity right well we have vital capacity which just has one more so what do I do? I take vital capacity, which has all these these three, and I subtract the one that we don't need, and that will give us inspiratory capacity. So inspiratory capacity is going to be right here. This is your solution. So when you plug the that information in, it should give you 4.5. Let's see. And that's right. Alright guys, thank you and good luck.